I am on a beautiful hiking trail in this forest. The trail is a closed loop. I can start from here, walk in any direction, cover the entire trail and reach back here. That reminds me of a puzzle. Three hikers set out to explore one such trail, starting at three different points. Each of them walks the entire trail at a similar speed without changing their direction in between. As they walk, will they cross paths? What are the chances that none of them meet each other? You might want to pause the video and think about it. Each hiker has two choices, to go clockwise or to go anti-clockwise. So for example, they might end up walking like this, clockwise, clockwise and anti-clockwise. In this case, the third hiker would cross paths with the other two. Or as another example, they could end up walking like this, all three of them clockwise. In this case, none of them would meet each other. A third example is this, anti-clockwise, clockwise and anti-clockwise. In this case too, the second hiker would cross paths with the other two. Now, to find the chances that none of them meet each other, we have to look at all the different possibilities. In total, there are these eight different ways in which they can walk, depending on the direction each of them chooses. Among these, only when all three of them choose to walk in the same direction, none of them will end up meeting each other. There are two out of eight cases where this happens. So that means that there's a 25% chance that none of them will meet. And there's a much higher 75% chance that one of them will cross paths with the other two. Now here's something for you to think about. What if there were just two hikers instead of three? What are the chances that they would cross paths? And what if there were four hikers? 